we queer up education. Utah removes the gay from Don't Say Gay Bill. I did think that there were going to be some questions about that, but when I looked at the language, it just seemed so common sense to me that we just simply make sure that we're having age-appropriate discussions about sexuality with our with, in, in the classroom. That, to me, seems just uh, really straightforward. But LGBTQ rights group Equality Utah is criticizing the bill, telling me, quote, Equality Utah is very dismayed to see a don't say gay bill introduced in Utah, especially when the Utah legislature enacted legislation repealing similar language from Utah code in 2017. This bill is damaging and stigmatizing to LGBTQ children and their families, and we will oppose it vigorously. A Utah lawmaker who introduced a bill concerning appropriate classroom instruction that was nearly identical to Florida's Don't Say Gay bill has removed LGBTQ plus specific references from the measure, representing a victory for LGBTQ plus equality advocates. State Representative Jeff Stenquist introduced HB 550, which seeks to ensure that classroom instruction or discussion of sexuality does not take place in grades K to three and only takes place in older grades in a manner that is both age and developmentally appropriate. Initially, Stenquist's bill specifically included the terms, quote, sexual orientation and gender identity when talking about sexual, when talking about sexuality but the Republican amended his bill in response to pushback from the LGBTQ plus community.